Well, welcome back. A looking at cloudy skies in place for the time being, but we are expecting skies to become partly cloudy overnight tonight with lows so low and mid 40s. So another chilly night in store for us. More sunshine though for tomorrow and Wednesday. Temperatures a bit milder. In fact, by Wednesday we should be back near 80 for a high. And then some showers pushing in for Thursday, perhaps a thunderstorm as well. Right now we're thinking the weekend looks nice, so great if you have any uh, plans outdoors. Laurel Fest going on in Wellsboro, of course, Father's Day weekend, so uh, it should be great for any outdoor activities uh, both Saturday and Sunday. High pressure pushing in uh, for tonight and tomorrow and Wednesday, and that's why we're thinking, well, a good deal of sunshine uh, here in the Twin Tiers and some moderating temperatures as well. But then all eyes on a low pressure system diving south and east from the Great Lakes. This is Wednesday. That'll be lifting a cold or a warm front our way, I should say, with some more clouds and eventually some showers and perhaps a thunderstorm for Thursday. But it's a quick mover. It'll push off to the south and east, and that will allow for some better weather to move in as we approach the weekend. 62 in Spencer, 65 in Corning, looking at low 60s in Penyon, 60 right now in Ridgebury, so definitely a chill in the air this evening. 63 in Dansville, 58 in Binghamton, a little bit warmer down towards Williamsport, 72 there. Had a couple sprinkles, light showers, a pass through western areas of Steuben County a short time ago, but uh, now we're just left with cloudy skies, and uh, most will remain dry here through the overnight period. In fact, a clearing trend. And uh, north of Lake Ontario, that'll push off towards the south tonight. So skies will become partly cloudy. Temperatures though low and mid 40s overnight tonight. We'll bounce back to 74 for a five degree guarantee tomorrow. Decent amount of sunshine expected, courtesy of that area of high pressure. Uh, future track showing the clearing skies for tonight. Good deal of sunshine for tomorrow. Mid 70s should do it for highs. Clear for tomorrow night. Uh, we'll drop back into the low and mid 40s. And then uh, heading into Wednesday, looks like some sunshine to start. I mentioned that warm front, though, that'll be approaching later in the afternoon. So more clouds just off to our west and eventually some showers and thunderstorms moving in uh, for the day on Thursday. Uh, as far as today's weather went with our five degree guarantee, we forecast 71. The unofficial high 68 for tonight down to 43. So another cool one, partly cloudy skies, or at least becoming partly cloudy, mostly sunny and warmer tomorrow. 74, our five degree guarantee. First warning 70 forecast showing the threat for a few showers, perhaps a thunderstorm on Thursday, Friday, and the upcoming weekend looking very nice, though, with sunny skies and moderating temperatures. In fact, looking at mid 80s by Father's Day, and that'll carry over into early next week as well. And a quick mention, uh, National Weather Service tomorrow evening, is having a flood sky warn class so you can learn all about flooding, flash flooding at the Town and Country Fire Department on Gardner Road in Horseheads. This is from 630 to 830 tomorrow. It's free, open to the public, good for families. Mm -hmm. More information on our Facebook page. And one of the things that, you know, we just had our severe weather special that aired last month, but one of the most important things you can do is be prepared because, of course, we do see flash floods here. That's our most often type of severe weather we get locally, flash flooding. All right, Joe, thank okay. you.